Well, I want to bring you more now of my special conversation with Melissa Rivers. Yesterday, she told me about the emotional moments after she took her mother, Joan, off life support. Melissa says that decision was an impossible one to make. That last day after we did remove the ventilator, for those few hours, all I wanted to do was say, no, 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 I've changed my mind, I've changed my mind, I've changed my mind. Put it back in, I'm not ready, I'm not ready, I'm not ready, I'm not ready. But who's ready? Even to the very end, Joan looked out for Melissa, and the best gift this mother gave to her daughter came in the words of her will. My mother left no loopholes. Um, you know, the standard written living will, and then she had written an addendum letter that actually said, uh, gave us a description of what she considered quality of life. And it was that she could still go on stage okay, for an hour, Okay, we can just prop her up and push her out there and be funny. I don't have to question and be like, oh, I'm, you know, I'm keeping her up and alive or in some semblance of life for my own selfish needs. Yeah. Because, yeah, okay, okay, well, we can just push her out on stage and let her sit there for an hour. That's, that's right. Uh, no, she actually put in and be funny. She basically took this decision out of my hands. She did. Which is a huge gift. Yeah, it is. Joan had a lifelong obsession with death. Melissa writes in the book of Joan that when she was a kid, quote, my mother would read part of an obituary in the paper and I'd have to guess facts about the deceased. So what was her fascination with it? I don't know, just being a Jew? I don't know. <laughs> I mean, she always used to call me before she would get on a plane and say, leave a message on my voicemail saying, just so you know, if the plane goes down, I have all my jewelry with me. You know, save this for the insurance company. I have all my jewelry with me. I can so hear her saying yeah. that right now. So, so my whole life, I'd be like, really? Like, this is grim. <laughs> yes. You're like, Mom, come on. Yeah. <laughs>